Well, it looks like we have a new Sega Genesis handheld coming to the market. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. And if you don't remember, back in the day we did have the Sega Nomad, which was a handheld Genesis made by Sega themselves. Well, this newest clone system is coming to us from Hyperkin, and we have the headline here from The Verge. Hyperkin has made a handheld Sega Genesis that plays original carts. And the new system you can see here is called the Mega 95. And it will have a 5 inch screen which I am assuming is an LCD and not an OLED. And the system will be able to dock and be able to play on your big screen with additional controllers plugged in. Now the system also has a switch to toggle between 4x3 and 16x9 modes, which I'm not sure why you would want 16x9 since the Genesis games were in 4x3. Maybe some people can't stand those black bars on the side, but I for one can't stand for all the circles to be ovals. And this thing will be great to take on the go because it will have a 10 hour battery life. Now the console appears to be a version of Hyperkin's Mega Retro N HD gaming console that plays Genesis games already. And that came out in 2018 and is still selling for $60. And I don't expect this to be based on FPGA and be super accurate in the emulation since it is sort of based on the Mega Retro N HD gaming console. Now the system does sell with the USB-C based dock, but we don't have a price just yet for what this will retail at. And we also don't have a release date just yet, so I don't know when we'll get to pick this up. And I've never used a Mega Retro N HD, so I can't vouch for its emulation, but I did read that some people had success getting Master System games to run through a converter. So I don't know if this handheld will do that as well. But let me know what you think. This might be a good pickup or a gift for your Sega fans out there, especially those with a good collection of physical games. Drop your comment below and let me know your thoughts. And if you like the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, consider doing so. It really does help the channel out quite a bit. I want to thank you for watching and be good.